Hello. Last time we went over uh, what's the difference between remake and remaster. We went over how it's better to be the original company that made the game in the first place to know uh, what was the original vision and what you had to sacrifice to achieve it uh, if you want to make a remake of your game. And uh, we talked about Halo a little bit, how uh, changing the graphics went pretty well, or at least improving them, keeping the gameplay as it was. But why would you remake or remaster a game? Well, I think that's a great topic for now. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Oh well. I still have a save, that's fine. It's not like we'll be returning there anyway. Or at least if we will, I think we'll go through the little uh, outpost over there. And we'll be able to flip some switch again to uh, open this again. I think, maybe. I mean, I'm not sure. Right, can I pick up a piece of corpse? Because that trip mine is kind of in a way, and I would like to, you know, avoid dying. I think that's a common uh, desire. I probably am supposed to sh just shoot the mine. I think it's not working. My gamer instincts have failed me. Well, now what? I can't jump. Because, you know, the lasers. Or should it just trip? Oh yeah, it should be... I think it's the detectors for the turret over there. Well, the turret turned on anyway. As opposed to a trip mine. The trip mine have blue laser. Well, anyway, right? I was supposed to avoid... Well, avoiding laser is good. Lasers. What? Oh. Well, that's just a head crab. Good distract the turret and I can just either shoot them hard enough or oh hey what's this grenades fell out of the uh, explosive box I guess it's good that well this book is never gonna last for long and it just stopped so since we don't have a gravity gun like in Half-Life 2 we're gonna have to get rid of the turret with explosives oh fuck that didn't work If you if he wouldn't be throwing the grenades for so long we would have be done earlier. Right. So all our health is gone already. And I can't jump up on the fucking box. I think I'm gonna have to cheat in more fucking jump height. Because it shouldn't be an issue. We've been over this, right? Yeah. Uh, oh get fucked. Pistol. I was supposed to be using some other gun because uh, I was saying there will be plenty enough ammo to go around and also you know if you limit yourself to using the worst gun as opposed to better one you'll be uh, ready to face off harder challenges with them anyway so it's not like we uh, uh, will be struggling now oh oh That was perfectly fine. It's fine. Don't worry about it. No loss was experienced. So why would you make a remake? Well, I'd say, at least, for the new generation, right? The new gener generation is used to um, a newer set of graphics, a better set of graphics. Oh, well. Another break glass. This time, that's a trip mine. Oh, fuck. It blew up this... Uh, Whatever casing for the button that activated the gate again, looks like. Can I push the cart? No. Well, it hurt me anyway. But at least less, I guess. Maybe. It's not helpful anyway. Either way. Um, what's this? Oh, this time it's water guns. Perfect, because I just pulled out my shotgun. Fuck. I could have grenaded them. Is this our face first death from the enemy? Possibly. Stop sucking at the game, there wouldn't be any. Good thing shotguns are very good at long ranges. It's either this or a pistol. Quiet. 
Now, we need a, a purple dra Oh, they're just laying on the floor, that's fine. We still need a purple drank anyway. Is there more water guns? Yeah. Stop running away. They're making this difficult. Stop resisting. Right, purple drank. Um, for the new generations, the new generation is used to better graphics. So if you go back in time, or at least get something, a, an old medium, it will look like shit, you know. Uh, movie in color is better than movie in black and white, in general at least. Uh, movie with sound is better than movie without one, in general. Um, yeah, so more pixels on the screen is better than less, in general. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just stand up the machine and drink soda one by one until our health reaches 100. I don't know what's your problem here. You Don't you like soda? Oh, we ran out of soda in this machine. Fortunately, there's this one. But unfortunately, this is dry already. Well, have it your way then. I was about to say, don't you like soda? Don't you like... Wouldn't you want to have soda here? But uh, this joke got cut short because of the, you know, limitations of physical space in the fridge, I guess. What's this? Menu, I guess. We're not gonna be delving deep into that. Oh, and there's also, you know, healing uh, bit. Because the windows were supposed to be, mm -hmm, and the doors. Right. So there are two entrances, entrances to the dining room or hall. And yeah. And you go through through the door, not through the window, you fucking Philistine, fucking monster, uh, barbarian, uncivilized idiot. Right. So, uh, explosive barrels. Should we explode them right away? I guess not. That's fine. There is this. Oh, we could do it the other way around. We could utilize the barrels to blow shit up there and get rid of the turrets. That should have worked. At least on one. And the rest of... Huh. And even the laser went off. That's nice. Can you? No, I cannot climb in there even though there's a ladder. That's not, not the kind of ladder that you'd be that would be useful for a player. So, is this the part where the soldiers show up yet? If I put it up, will it work again? Probably no, it's sm not. It's smoking already, meaning it's broken. You know, the blue magical smoke from the electronics. Three voting guns at once! We're almost dead, that's nice. Hmm. There's one more, I'm pretty sure. And I'm almost dead. But we've persevered this time. Good. It means I've got scale. Better save. Right, new generation, right? They they prefer more pixels. And I'm gonna tell you, even when I was a an earlier generation, I preferred more pixels. And I'm pretty sure you prefer more pixels as well. I mean... 8-bit uh, is now, or 16, you know, the, the pixel art is only a style now anymore. It's not the major uh, trend in graphics. Because, you know, more pixels equals better looks, obviously. Is this where we're supposed to be going? Yeah. But we're probably not supposed to be jumping up in here. Because of the jump. Maybe. I'm not sure. Pro we, we should probably be able to, I mean... Who cares? Uh, the other guy that plays uh, Gordon Freeman usually. Fuck. Headcrab killed us. Forgive me, for I'll now commit a seppuku. Now, since I'm better now. Um, right, what? Ah, yes, better graphics. Right, that's broken. Also, like I said, there were some limitations back in the day that would make your vision impossible to create, so uh, with the time progression you could implement things that you were missing out on. Now... Fuck! I miss again. They got me again. Will I not be able to get through this section because I'm trying to use a shotgun? Should I be using a crowbar? That's probably not gonna help. 
if I can't hit them with a shotgun, how am I gonna super? How am I gonna hit them with a crowbar? Right. So for the new generation, even though the story of the game, if your game possesses any kind of story, is the same, and doesn't need any uh, review or remake, um, the graphics would uh, improve the reception. So even though the old, the previous is fuck off. I'm gonna throw a grenade soon enough at them. Did I miss an entire blast? The video speaks for itself. Now, five health left. We're gonna have to figure something out about that. Um, we're not pressing that button. More lasers, meaning more turrets. This guy is dead. Is, shouldn't that have been? Isn't that a part of the original game as well? Isn't there a guy that crosses the uh, laser for the turret in the original to let you know how that works as opposed to uh, just tripping the mines? Oh, and, the, and the, it's an ice level. Uh huh. How about you pick up that turret and tip it over so that it can't activate? It's essentially broken, or just at least face it to the wall. Don't cross the beams, they say, for the safety of their own whatever. Maybe I should be using this. I should... It's probably... Um, just jump up. Jump on top of the fucking crate, Gordon. I cheated in a better jump, not for you to not be able to jump on the fucking crate. Is that how it was supposed to be going? Hmm. Can I jump across the boxes? Can I jump on top of the box? I'm gonna have to cheat in a higher jump. Because this is getting ridiculous. Right. Can I get across all the way over to the other turret? Well, only one way to find out, is it? Uh, no. Um. Hmm. Is there water at the bottom? No. Does the ladder go all the way down? Yes, even though only some of it is weirdly lit. I think I'm gonna utilize that for something. Well, I guess not. So the newer audience, right? Hey, hold on. I'm pressing the wrong buttons. The newer audience would like to experience the game in better graphics as well, because you already played the game, right? And... Uh, the old game exists, the story is available for everyone to experience either way and if you're buying the game again, you're just doing yourself a disservice, you already played the game essentially ah, fuck me you already played the game and you're paying twice for the same product even though there might be, it might be a remake and you know, the gameplay is different so maybe there is some legitimacy to that really, but then again you're going by nostalgia and uh, brand recognition as opposed to uh, some innovative is it just impossible am I gonna have to do a no clip to just make sure or am I incompetent what I'm trying to say is don't pay twice for the same product we're doing no clip fuck you right so I flew around as a ghost to make sure uh, if that ladder leads anywhere and it doesn't uh, so that would confirm, I think, well, it doesn't confirm anything, but I'm pretty sure there is an invisible wall around the ladder as well to discourage you from that. And there is also a death plane at the bottom of the of the shaft. It's not a matter of fall damage. And I was killed as a ghost as well. So uh, we're not going to be going there, I guess. The only way forward is across these. And I'm supposed to not get hit well, not catch on the, uh, what is this, fans? Probably. And also get a run running starting start, running start? Yeah, running start. Didn't work, fuck you. Here, there's a solution, a gun. Thanks for your help, scientists. No. Look how unsafe it is. Useless fox. At least there's some health here. Right, so. A trip mine. Can I avoid it? Probably. Probably not. 
Through here? No. You! Yeah? How helpful are you? I feel like I could push him into the mine. Can I push him into the trip mine? Trip wire? Can I? No, I can't make him run by shooting around him. Uh, the terrorism is not modeled in this game. Yeah, so like I was saying, if you're paying twice for the same product, you're doing yourself a disservice. You should have uh, first have waited, second have pirated the game originally, and then waited for the remaster once they fix uh, the graphics and also bugs. Well, fuck you then if you're so useless. Fucking idiot. Oh, I'm supposed to just scroll under, right? So now that the military has control over PA, uh, Shurgan would probably be more in order, I think. Also, we've got f we've got essentially 70 health. It's still gonna be hard, I think. Well, there's no going back. More ammo. This dude is dead. Is this the Mr. Punner? Good think you're dead. Get fucked. Uh, right. So, you should have pirated the game and waited for the for the next release. I mean, they're gonna charge you full price for the for the remake, right? Only a few games, I think, let you have the new release for free if you had the old one. Uh, let me tell you, Mass Effect is not doing that. Skyrim did that, though. And Resident Evil is not doing that either, so... There's your solution to... well, there's your answer who's doing that. At least a few people, right. Um, dead... nothing. I think the original... ah, exactly. I think the original game did it better, cause... Uh, the soldiers couldn't have spotted you. Here you're fucking in front of that, um, what is it, elevator shaft, and you're wearing bright orange. So they'll spot you and they'll shoot you. You idiot. Shotgun, shotgun, and um, uh, armor. Alright. If only I could pick up a propane bottle. I can just pick up the smaller one. I think I got him. Does that do anything? No. And we'll be picking up MP5 off of this. Oh, hey, there you, there you are. If only you could hit the target. We'll be picking up F MP5. Is this any more accurate than, uh, you know, everything else? We don't have the underbarrel. Who the fuck? Is it, is it real? Is it actual? Because I know that's what the original game had, but I don't think there is an under underbarrel uh, detachable, or attachable at least, a uh, grenade launcher for an MP5. There are for assault rifles, but not necessarily for submachine guns. I don't think so. Oh, and there's there was also this here. Can I only have 150? That's kind of lame. You think since it's a submachine gun and spits lead more uh, freely, faster is the word, uh, you'd be able to pick up more ammo for it for later, you know. But I guess not. So, what's behind here? Gr two grenades that I'm full on as well. I should have thrown a grenade at those head grabs after all. I would have recuperated already. Yeah, so submachine gun. How accurate it is? It's probably not accurate since it's full auto. It's not that it's ha it has a stock or anything. Yeah, let's say it's accurate enough. I don't know. Uh, right. So, this was lying here uh, before the soldier came. I'm pretty sure. So, of course, scientists decided not to defend himself with the fucking submachine gun. But then again, he might have been thinking he, uh, he'll he be saved. And also, it lies here, but I can pick up the gun off of the soldier. So, and there was only one soldier. It's not like I'm picking up one gun off of one soldier and using it to kill another right away. And I'm running out of ammo so I can uh, fill up from here. No. No, I can't. So... I don't know why is there a free floating another gun here. Uh, yeah. Also, this is sticking into the wall. That's not how uh, physics work. I guess the place the wall got so used up that uh, the spool fits in so deep uh, that that's possible. Obviously, I'm sure of it. Right. Yeah. So paying twice, right? Also, uh, with the remakes and availability for uh, PC. 
you know, there is at least the excuse that you didn't have the console, so now you can buy the game full price and all. Uh, and with the uh, improved shit on PC after the port. So, uh, at least there's some value in there. At least it's the original release right away uh, on the on the platform we've got. Stop shooting me. Uh, we're talking about frags, so the soldiers are in full uh, effect. Uh, oh shit, the grenade is right here. I, c I can't get back into the... No. There's just an there's just an invisible wall. The door didn't close. Doors didn't close. They just put an invisible wall here. Cuz that makes sense. Oh yeah, and that's another issue of the combat uh, system in Black Mesa. They'll just throw grenades at you because I as they've got an unlimited uh, number of grenades. Or there's also that they can move and shoot now. And they'll be flunking you and shooting you, giving you no time to react to anything. Also, the grenades, you know, the grenades are not... The grenades aren't glowing like in the Half-Life 2, so you know where they are. They hardly even make the noise. They sparkle a little bit, which the, grenade th the grenades don't do. They're just the typical uh, GI uh, uh, pineapple grenades that don't glow and they also don't spark it's not a uh, firecracker with a with a fuse sticking out the, s the fuse is on the inside and then it blows up so but they needed a way for you to see the grenade and all of them failed there they don't have a uh, an audio cue it's well you know grenades don't usually but it's also not call of duty so you don't have a marker where the grenade is or anything like that uh, so you don't get a marker where the grenade is, because it's not a Call of Duty or anything... I don't know, futuristic... M m well, this is a first-person shooter, but I don't know. Out of first-person shooters, military first-person shooters, they give you more fear of a challenge. They don't have an audio cue, they barely have a visual cue. They hardly clank uh, against the floor either, or even. Uh, so, that's bad, and you're being um, drowned in them. Did the grenades sparkle in the previous game? I mean, the original game? Don't remember, don't know. Possibly, maybe. Don't know, look it up, I mean, you know. Attention. What an unpleasant Four. buzz. Science. Personnel. Report. For, immediate for immediate questioning. Not for immediate saving, for questioning. Mm-hmm. Would it be enough for it to... I think I got him. But then again, I could have used bullets as well. Or avoid the problem. Oh, these ones are... Oh, and it dropped the fucking barrel right away. They're attached to the... To the walkway right above, not, not far off in the fucking distance. That's upsetting. Right. Right. Uh, remakes, yeah. And as well, with the full price, I mean, wait for the sales as well. At least if you if you really want to buy the same game, game twice, at least wait for the sales instead of buying it right away. You Like I said, you already know the story. The gameplay can wait. You already bought the game already, as I said. Uh, so, uh, we're gonna end up here through the conveyor belt eventually because we're gonna be looking for shit aren't you missing the word is uh, yeah also the problem here with the pistol is that when you rapid fire even a single shot it already gets uh, inaccurate It, it's not that you get more spread over time with a longer uh, sustained fire you just lose accuracy immediately great design uh, right yeah what games right don't buy the same game same game twice pirate at least one of them you know uh, you already showed support the first time nobody asked for just a little bit better uh, textures to spend 
uh, another full price on the game. Like, um, you know, I'm talking uh, Mass Effect. Mass Effect isn't that old of a game, is it? At this point it might as well be, but... Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna steal it as well. I've got the originals, all three. Collectioner edition for the number two. Oh, you just added trip mines? Or did I... what? How did that work? Where did I come from? Hmm. Ah, fuck! What the shit? How did that work? Why did they activate? What bullshit is this? And I just took hits. Fuck me. I'm gonna play up until this point. I'm not taking that hit. Hey, look, I'm doing rolls. Is it because my head got blown off? It's not like I've got a body in this game. Anyway, I guess that will be it for today. Uh, we'll see each other next time uh, from the spot where I... Uh, screwed up here at least I think so no I crawled in here I'm kind of dumb I guess well I just didn't pay attention it's fine I'm not gonna self deprecate here uh, but why did those activate what kind of fucking bullshit is this? these are trip mines not the laser wires trips for the turrets uh, dumb ridiculous dumb so yeah, thanks for sticking by. Hopefully we'll see each other next time in something else I play for you for free. And in the meantime, interact with the video and interact with the channel. Hit the subscribe button, maybe hit the bells so you know uh, there's a new video from me. YouTube operates on recommendations now, but if you really want to keep up with the things you subscribe to, the things you actually opted into, hit that bell. Subscription isn't enough anymore. So yeah, okay, thanks, bye.